In the meantime, we'll talk about a lot of people in Chicago wondering about their own safety, and no wonder, right? At least eight people were killed, dozens injured in shootings over the weekend alone. In some neighborhoods, people have simply given up on calling the cops, saying the city fails to protect them. One former big city police chief blaming the mayor in Chicago. Lori Lightfoot talks about what's dangerous, The cops are dangerous. No, she's dangerous. What's happening is people who live in the most vulnerable communities in, in Chicago, in south and west Chicago, vulnerable communities, who speaks for them? Who's protecting them? Well, Mike Tobin picks up the coverage. A deadly weekend there, Mike. Hello in Chicago. Yeah, Bill, it was a warm, sunny weekend. Life is returning to normal, but sadly, returning to normal means a lot of gun violence in the city of Chicago. In the Puerto, Puerto Rican Pride celebration this weekend, uh, there was a rear-end collision. Giovanni Arzuga was in a car. People swarmed the car, and uh, according to reports, Arzuga was shot at point-blank range in the head. A woman in his car was shot in the neck. At last report, she's in critical condition. Overall, police report uh, 54 people were shot over the weekend in Chicago, eight people killed. Mayor Lori Lightfoot continues to call for covered tougher gun laws and now with democrats in control of congress and the white house she's asking for federal help but one activist says chicago already has tough gun laws but guns used in street crimes don't travel legal channels noting that the overwhelming majority of gun violence victims are black